Hey Aquarius, welcome to your weekly Zodiac Tarot reading. This reading is for January the 22nd to the 28th. Um, before I get into your cards for the week, I just want to share with you what I'm initially picking up for you guys energetically. And what I am getting is you guys are going to get offered a job. You guys are going to get offered um, a job and it's going to be very, um, it's a very abundant offer for you. Even when I say job, it doesn't necessarily mean like a physical, typical job. It could be that something is presented to you to do, a task to do, yeah? And if you choose to accept that, you could end up getting some sort of karmic reward. Do you know what I mean? Something in the universe, the universe could be like, okay, here you go. You've done this, you've helped with this, you've achieved this, here you go. So... Yes, it might be in the literal sense of you, someone's going to come along and ask you if you want a job. And I do believe that for a lot of you. I do believe it's going to be that for a lot of you. But again, getting out of that human mind of limitation, it's like it could be many things. But it's something that is very, 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 very good. Um, there's a very kind man that's going to be coming into your life. This is actually a male. A, a, a gen, gender wise, it's a male. Um, he's going to be like... Is an older man and he's going to be coming into your life and he's very, very helpful, very, very kind, um, very, very supportive. Might feel like the father you never had or maybe remind you of a father if you've lost a father. It's like this fatherly energy that's kind of coming in here. Also, you guys are going to be uncovering something. You guys, yeah, right, are giving me, some of you give me like this detective energy. Some of you give me this solutions to problems energy some of you are giving me this innovation energy but you're going to be uncovering something there's like this discovery and uncovering um here that you guys are going to be doing that you guys are going to be getting and it's going to be very very it's going to be useful for you personally in your lives but it's also going to be useful for other people um beautiful energy this is that i'm getting here very it feels really good it feels really exciting it feels beautiful um, be careful of sugar right now for some of you. I don't know whether some of you have got feel like you know you you consuming too much sugar. Sometimes I feel like an insect, and all I want to do is consume sugar. And I actually I feel like an insect. But just be careful. Yeah, if you are feeling like you are consuming a bit too much sugar, just be careful. And that's for health reasons, like maybe like diabetes or something like that. Just be cautious of that. Maybe it's your teeth. I don't know, sugar ruined my teeth. Um, what else was I getting for you guys? It's getting something else, I swear. It might come to me. I'm just going to get into your reading. It'll probably just pop back in if there's something else. Um, <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> okay, so... Let's get into your cards for the week ahead. The 22nd to the 28th of Jan. Um, if you're somebody that does like to check out your sun, your moon and your rising, maybe check out your other planetary placements as well. Maybe check out um, your Jupiter, your Mars, your Uranus and see what signs they're in and maybe watch those videos because these readings are like a whole mixed bag. They're not just focused on love or money or whatever. It's whatever comes through. So you might find something interesting and useful. Problems are going to be solved for you. Okay, there's going to be certain problems that are solved for you. Seriously, if you get a job offer, whether it's in a literal sense or a task that you need to do, even if you don't want to do it, it might be something that you feel like, oh, do it. It's going to solve a problem for you. We've got the sun here. We've got the six of cups. That's beautiful. The knight of cups. Oh, God, guys, look at you. The queen of swords in reverse. The ace of pentacles. There's some readings this week, and the energy that I've been downloading, it feels like that is what is wanted to be communicated in the cards as well. Um... And this is kind of one that feels like that. Sometimes it's like completely different messages. But this is kind of feeling like it is kind of talking about this kind of, and I just feel it. It's like, so, it's like being screamed at me, take the job offer. 
you know, accept the, the task. Um, it, honestly, it's going to solve major problems for you or, or it's going to solve many problems for you. It might, problems might not be major, but it's going to solve a whole heap of problems for you. But here, you might, I just feel like you might not want to. You might not want to do it. But it's going to be good. You're going to avoid an issue or something. You're going to avoid some sort of stress this week. There's going to be help that comes in and helps you. Guys, you'll have to let me know if the readings are resonating with you. Let me know in the comments. I'm really loving connecting with such beautiful people in the comments. Honestly, the community. Since I've come back to YouTube, the community that I'm connecting with are so beautiful. Honestly, yeah, you do get the odd one or two and I'm just like, oh my God. But overall oh my god i just feel so grateful and i'm just loving i'm loving the community that is that that is like kind of growing with this page i love it singing to my soul guys there's something you're not seeing or you're not understanding or recognizing this week but you're gonna have support and assistance from others to lead you to recognizing they're gonna you're gonna you're gonna kind of they i feel like they're gonna kind of tap into your heart to ha to lead you over your head or make you think about something so maybe you have like an epiphany or think about things in a different way here you're you're gonna start being led by your heart in regards to a situation and that's going to help you to take action and make a decision and do something. And it is related to what this is related to a, a task or a job. It's related to the messages that I was giving you. Um, bottom of the deck, we've got 10 of cups. We've got here the sun, the six of cups, the knight of cups, the queen of swords in reverse, the ace of pentacles, the eight of wands, the moon, justice, the tower in reverse. Three of Pentacles, Four of Cups, the Ace of Swords, the Three of Cups, the Ace of Cups, the Four of Swords, the Empress, the Knight of Swords, and the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so, got some happiness coming in at the beginning of the week. There's something that is going to make you very, very happy. You're attracting it in because of your vibration. Somebody is going to come in and connect with you, make you an offer. They're going to make you an offer. They're very... Um, they want to love you. They want to help you. It might not be in a romantic sense that they want to love you or help you. For some of you, it could be. For others of you, it might not be. But they want to give you something as a gesture of love. Do you know what I mean? And it's genuine as well. It's innocent. It's genuine. They don't want anything from you. It's not like they want to give you something because they want something in return. They want to give you something with love. Even if it looks like they want something in return. That might be what they're offering you. Again, well, I'm being pulled back into a job offer or a task. And you may feel like, oh no, I don't want to do that. It might feel repelling or draining for you. But actually, that offer is what is going to open something up for you or solve a load of problems for you. Okay, so it is like, that is the intention here that I'm getting. And it might be a bit confusing because on the surface, there might be a lack of trust or... There might be this closed offness into that. There might be thinking of of this in a more negative way. But it's also the universe is working through this person to give you an opportunity, to give you an offer. I feel like it's going to solve problems for you financially. It's going to solve a lot of financial issues or it could be many different issues. It could be things to do with work or it's going to, even if it's not solving problems, maybe it's going to offer you more abundance, which could then help to solve other problems. And it's going to help to move you forwards. It's going to help you. And I feel this is going to help you in regards to, um, it's on many levels. It's like it's going to help you to be more heartfelt, which is going to help you to be more magnetic. OK, but it's going to help you as well to see beyond the surface of things, um, which is going to open up your mind. So basically, you're, it's going to be opening up your heart. It's going to be open up, opening up your mind. It's going to help you to make clearer decisions. Um, it's going to clear up a load of karma as well here, because I feel like 
a task at hand is going to clear a load of karma. Okay, it's going to help to avoid a tower moment for you. And I feel that working, it's going to involve other people and working with other people. This is what's going to avoid a tower moment for you. But also these people that you're going to be connecting with are going to be supporting you. Yes, you're going to be supporting them, but they're also going to be supporting you to get into this state of being of more conscious awareness, seeing beyond the surface, being more um, emotionally open, which is going to be make you more magnetic and attract things to you that you want. Um, more things that you will enjoy and love and open up your mind as well so it's like they're going to help you with things there's something here that you feel that you are lacking and it is some sort of emotion i remember now sorry guys it's just come through another thing that i was getting for you guys creativity if we've got any artists here right creativity is going to be flowing through you big time anybody who has not never maybe been interested in art you may find yourself being drawn to art or to the arts of some sort i'm getting mainly like painting and drawing and stuff like that but it could be involving other arts but this is going to be a big energy that flows through you that's what that's what i had brain blockage about earlier um but yeah so you're going to be around some good people that are going to work with you and help to get you into this state you're also going to be helping them it's teamwork here everyone's going to end up happy you're still not seeing certain things you don't understand certain things or you don't understand the purpose or the point or how to move forwards here i feel like again it's like you're just being led by your emotions and the, the physical support with other people is helping you to be led with your emotions because you're going to really like the people you're connected with and you're going to really enjoy what you're doing emotionally even if mentally you feel like oh it's like there's going to be something that happens here emotionally by connecting with certain people it's going to fill you with love and that is going to make you start thinking differently that is then going to put you into like an empress energy it could also this could also involve a mother for some of you as well this could also involve um it could be that you're working with a mother or it could be that you're thinking about a mother, you've thought about a mother in a certain way and then you start to think differently about a mother um, because of working with other people. I mean, for some of you, it could be working with children, for some of you even here. It could be that a child helps you to shift your belief system about mothers or your mother or something here. For some, of, That's just for a small group of you. Um, there could be some sort of mother healing thing that's going on with you here. But overall, it's what, and if we're going to talk in like a non-emotional sense here, what's going to happen is your, your heart is going to be opening up. Your mind is going to be opening up. You're going to be a lot more attractive, magnetic. Manifestations are going to come in quicker um, and in bigger ways. And things, your life, you'll start to draw into you things that make you happy and things that, bring you joy and peace but your mind will expand and you will be able to see beyond the surface of things or in a deeper level than what you do right now you'll be able to see more dimensions and understand more dimensions which will help you to make um it will help you to make decisions in a different way but yeah basically here um, you're going to be shifting into this divine feminine sort of energy by focusing on your emotions here um, which is then going to help you to move forwards with decisions regarding to work. There may be news come in about a job, as I say, or some sort of work to do. There could be that come in, or it might be that you make certain decisions. If this has already come in, you can make decisions and you will accept the task at hand um, because you're being supported here by, by people um, and they're kind of guiding you. And then you see things in a slightly different way here, which will lead to a ten of cups so there's going to be joy and happiness for everybody that is involved sorry guys um it's going to close you're going to take action here and the task that you're going to be accepting and taking action upon is going to close up a lot of judgments for you which is which creates a limitation and keeps you in a sense of dissatisfaction or a lower vibration so you're going to be raising your own your vibration from this task that's what I've got for you. I'm going to leave it there. I hope that it's helpful. You'll have to let me know if it's helpful or if you resonate. 
If you did like this reading, any thumbs ups are greatly appreciated. Um, and if you want to see more, feel free, free to subscribe. Anybody interested in personal readings, there is a link in the description that you can click on and it will take you to a listing where there's a detailed description. The personal readings I do are live video call, one-to-one -one video calls, which I also record and then send, send a link so you can download it and keep the video. Um, or if that is not convenient, I can do, I can do like a pre-recorded reading for you. If that's something you're interested in, as I say, the information is in the description. Other than that, take care guys. Take care. Have a beautiful week. Thank you.